This kitchen strainer costs $100, but compared to some of the cheaper ones, it's so much easier to install. Of course, before we get started, we have to dismantle the old one, which is as easy as installing the new one because they're the exact same strainer. Just a side note, never be nice to anything that you're taking apart. With the old one out, we're going to clean the bottom and the top and drop in our strainer. I'm using plumber's putty underneath the top of the strainer. Down below, you have a rubber washer first, then the metal washer, and then the outer washer with the screws. That will press against that metal washer, creating the seal. How many times is this guy going to say washer? Last but not least, we're going to slide over our tailpiece, tighten it, and do some water testing. That's it.